Hello friends, Tony here. I have created some videos about the filament version 3 and I had a comments on YouTube if I can create a filament tutorial. And that's what I'm going to start today. So I'm going to create a full tutorial about the filament and I will cover almost uh, everything so you can learn in this tutorial all about the filament. We are going to build a employee management project and through the building a project we'll cover almost everything you need to know to build a project with uh, filament version 3. Okay, so let's open the terminal. I'm going to use a warp terminal here. So let's say Laravel new and the name I'm going to name it filament tutorial hit enter now if you want you can install a breeze starter kit or a jet stream but I'm going to say no starter kit here I'm going to use past and no git repository okay so the application is ready and I'm going to navigate there and let's open with a VS code I'm going to use the VS code as a code editor now first I'm going to go to .env file and here we have the database name which is filament underscore tutorial I'm going to copy this and create this database I use uh, table plus so here I'm going to say new paste that name click OK and yeah, here we have filament tutorial and now let's close this and let's run artisan migrate so artisan I have a alias for PHP artisan I'm going to say migrate here hit enter and yeah we have the users table reset tokens failed jobs and personal access token table in our database so if I refresh now yeah here we are now let's go and install the filament so I'm going to open filament documentation get started and let's zoom it this one okay now we need to run the composer require filament slash filament and the version 3.0 stable let's copy this also we need to add the dash w here so let's paste that in hit enter and then php artisan filament install dash dash panels now when we install the dash dash panels we have form builder table builder notification uh, info list all the filament installed okay now paste that in hit enter and i have star in that so i'm going to say no now and we are okay now if i navigate the project so filament tutorial dot test yeah here we are because we have installed now the filament and by default filament has the path slash admin yeah here we have now the we need to log in to navigate the slash admin right now we don't have any user in our database so if I go to the users here it's empty we can create the user through the command so php artisan make filament user is uh, not necessary to create through the command line if you have installed Jetstream or uh, Travel Breeze, you can go to the register or you can create a new user on the database right here. But I'm going to do in the terminal here. PHP artisan make filament user, give it a name, and I'm going to say admin admin at admin.com. Hit enter and add the password. Okay, now the success admin at admin.com. Let's copy that and paste it right here. 
add the password, sign in, and we are in the admin dashboard. This is what the fina filament admin panel looks like. We have here the name of the user. We can change the dark theme or light theme or we can choose the system. Also we can sign out here. And that's it about this video. I hope you enjoy friends and don't forget if you like uh, such a video and if you want to uh, learn filament, subscribe to my channel, like this video, share with your friends and see you in the next one. All the best.